in the current generation one out of eight couple faces infertility issues to address this infertility issue with respect to our ancient yogic tradition atmic yoga have started the get pregnant naturally with yoga infertility series previously we had discussed the most prominent reasons for infertility emotional blocks that causes infertility yoga poses that should be practiced by both men and women to improve their fertility and meditation that can unblock our swadhisthana chakra which is responsible for the reproduction and pleasure in human beings if you have missed watching those videos i'll be giving the link of them in the description box below please do check it out in continuation with atmic yoga's infertility series today we are going to discuss most important five hasta mudras that can improve our fertility so let's get started with me ranjani a certified yoga teacher specialized in pregnancy yoga training and a meditation coach from atmic yoga to give an introduction about hasta mudras hasta mudras are specific hand gestures or seals or switch which helps us to channelize our energy to different parts of the body our entire body our entire universe is made up of pancha mahabhutas fire water earth air and space and imbalance in these elements in our body causes diseases Hasta mudras is a branch of yoga which utilizes the energy of this pancha mahabhutas that resides in our hands. Thus practicing this hasta mudras over a period of while helps us to balance these elements in our body and helps to get rid of these diseases. So let's start with the powerful mudras to improve fertility in both men and women. The first mudra is yoni mudra. Yoni means vagina, the primary female reproductive organ. so any women who faces issues in her reproductive organs like hormonal imbalance pcos ovarian cysts endometriosis irregular periods any kind of issue related to her reproductive organ should practice this yoni mudra for 48 minutes in a day for 3 months beginners can start with 15 minutes a day and gradually increase the duration to 48 minutes a day the mudra should be practiced like this bending the three fingers little finger ring finger and the middle finger pressing tips. the tip of these three fingers together touching the tips of the index fingers and pressing the thumb together so this is yoni mudra a detailed video on how to practice this mudra what are the precautions and what are the benefits that we are going to get from this mudra is updated as a separate video in this playlist the link will be updated in the description box below This mudra should be placed near the yoni and sit comfortably. One can close the eyes or keep it open and focus on the breathing while practicing this mudra. Second mudra is linga mudra. Similar to yoni mudra, the lingam represents the penis, the primary male reproductive organ. so issues related to male reproductive organ can be managed by practicing this linga mudra consistently so this mudra helps to overcome the male fertility issues like erectile dysfunction low sex drive linga mudra improves the fire element in our body increases oxygen the prana increases the vitality and potency and thus improving the male fertility but one should remember that there are many precautions that one should follow before and after practicing this linga mudra so do watch a separate video on linga mudra that have been posted before to know the precautions before you add this linga mudra in your routine so how to do this mudra press both your palms together clasping your fingers the left finger the left thumb finger should be extended outside and the right side thumb and the index finger should be making a circle around the left thumb so this represents the lingam clasp your hands tight and keep it near your chest and stay focused on your breathing Beginners can start practicing this mudra for 5 minutes a day and then gradually increase according to your body type. And the third mudra that we are going to practice is Prithvi mudra the earth element mudra. Earth is a vital source of energy. All the form of nutrients, all the form of food that we consume into our body comes from the earth. 
when there is an imbalance in the earth's element in our body the female may not be able to produce fertile eggs and the male may not be able to produce healthy sperm when one practices prithvi mudra regularly it balances the earth element in their body touching the tips of the ring finger and the thumb finger together and placing them over your lap focusing on your breath is prithvi mudra when one practices this prithvi mudra it helps to overcome this kind of infertility issues like low sperm count or no sperm count absence of sperm or in case of women when she is suffering with conditions related to the formation of x women need earth element throughout her pregnancy as she is creating a body within her womb a new life in her womb in relationship with the fertile nature of her earth we call her the mother earth The fourth mudra is Varuna mudra. It represents the water element. The water element is representation of our sacral chakra, the Swadhisthana chakra, which is the location of our reproductive organs and our reproductive energy. Thus, by practicing the Varuna mudra, increasing the water element in our body, we can increase the reproductive energy within us. men with sperm related issues like ejaculation problems and women with issues related to her periods irregular periods or white discharge can get benefited by practicing this varuna mudra how to perform touch the tips of your little finger and thumb finger together extend the other three fingers and place them over your lap and sit comfortably and focus on your breathing from 10 minutes to 20 minutes in a day Avoid practicing this Varuna Mudra when the weather in your place is very cold like in this case of rainy season or winter season or if you are suffering from any cold related issues like cough cold or any kapha related issues as it will increase the issue I'll be soon posting a video on Varuna Mudra highlighting all the benefits the final mudra that we are going to see is the Shepana Mudra the fifth mudra If you have faced miscarriages in the past or holding on to trauma of not having a baby for many years might have caused a negative block within your mind which in turn will increase your stress and increase the reasons for your infertility. So this Sepana Mudra helps to remove the negative energy from the body and helps one to conceive naturally. So how to perform this mudra? Interlock both your fingers together and there's no need to keep the palms tight as we do for the linga mudra keep them in a relaxed state and extend your index fingers outside and point them to the floor you are shooting out your negative energy from your body onto the floor so do not keep anything valuable in front of you while practicing this mudra This Sepana Mudra increases the positive energy flow in our body decreasing our stress insomnia depression and improving the reasons for our fertility avoid practicing this Sepana Mudra during menstruation do practice this mudra every day in the morning and every day in the evening not more than that So with this we have completed our five important mudras that is helpful to improve the fertility choose one or two mudras that suits your body that suits your condition and do practice them every day for 48 to 90 days consistently to receive a positive news about your bundle of joy mudra therapy becomes highly beneficial when it's combined with yoga asanas so also do practice the yoga asanas for men and women to boost fertility to improve your fertility along with the mudra therapy in short let's discuss the mudras that we have seen the first mudra is the yoni mudra the second mudra is the linga mudra The third mudra is the Prithvi mudra. The fourth mudra is the Varuna mudra and the fifth mudra is the Sepana mudra. I hope you enjoyed watching our content. If you like our content consider subscribing to our channel and press the bell icon to get instantly notified whenever we post the next video. You can also follow us in our Instagram and Facebook pages by clicking the links in the description box below. You can also get a copy of my book Yogic secrets of eating for weight loss as obesity is also one major reason for infertility. You can also join with us in a WhatsApp group where you can discuss about your queries related to health, fitness, diet, yoga and mudras for free with the professionals directly. Do give us a thumbs up and share this video with your friends and family who might also get benefited by watching this video because sharing is caring. 
தேங்க்யூ ஸோ மச் ஃபார் ஸ்டேயிங் டில் த எண்ட் நன்றி வணக்கம்